Hello everybody, in this video we're going to talk about how to find duplicate files such as duplicate mp3s in your iTunes, uh, duplicate photos, duplicate uh, program files, anything that is making your Macintosh computer run slower than it used to. Many times this is due to duplicate files. So we're going to talk about how to clean out our computer of duplicate files and keep it running as quickly as possible. So the first thing we want to do is we want to go to www.duplicatefilesoftware.com So here we go to duplicatefilesoftware.com and then we want to just check out this program right here uh, tidy up and that is the program that I use, that is the program that I recommend. So what we're going to do is we'll click this link and it will take us to the Tidy Up web page which will then let us download the software. So you'll click download now. Uh, for the sake of this video I've already downloaded the software. So once you click that link it will then uh, show up in your downloads right here you'll double click that and then you'll be able to install tidy up and you'll see this screen right here the tidy up screen you'll drag that over into here double click that icon and it'll start up this program tidy up so here we are I'm sorry about that here we are there's tidy up and as you can see you can search for duplicates of all kinds images images by X E X I F aperture photos I photos music, music by tag, iTunes music, applications, other files and packages, and miscellaneous. And you can select right here what which drive you want to search for duplicate files. So you can actually do this on a removable drive or you can zero in on certain folders. Uh, so in the case of this example you can see that I checked the Macintosh hard drive and in this example I chose music. I wanted to find duplicate mp3 folder files that were wasting space. So I use that and it takes a couple minutes to scan and it scanned about I don't know a few thousand files and then the results screen comes up like this. Here's the results screen. So these are all the duplicate mp3 files that it found in my folder and as you can see it starts to add up um, it doesn't look like much but it starts to add up there's 579 items in here and it's a very cool program because it easily allows you to compare the two files and in most of these cases these were just uploaded on the same day and this is just wasted space so you can choose to move and copy you can choose to burn the duplicates and then this program will automatically get rid of the ones you don't need. Uh, you can also, which is really cool, click the MP3. It'll show you where it's where it's being stored, and it will also show you the information about the file. And the cool thing is that when you check out the information on the file, it shows you everything you need to know, and you can even preview it like right, right there, which is very cool. Uh, so this is the example of how we would remove duplicate mp3 files and I just chose mp3s because I think a lot of people are looking how to clean up their iTunes and this is a great piece of software that will let you do that and once you clean up your duplicate mp3s, your duplicate photos uh, when you upgrade programs sometimes they leave behind duplicate files when you get rid of these things you're gonna see a great difference in the speed of your Mac so I definitely recommend that you guys check out this website, uh, duplicatefilesoftware.com. So this is back one. Uh, you can get some advice here too, some reasons why things aren't running the way they should. So just check out duplicatefilesoftware.com. You can download this program right here. It's a free trial, and you'll see the great difference that it will make in your Mac. Alright, thanks for watching.